I got the Hyper ET body here guys. I'm gonna be painting this. Make sure you clean up the surface really well once you finish masking, all right? Make sure you push on all the edges here so there's no um, the pressure or the flow of the paint escaping and going internally. So you have to push against it. Do like three coats and before you begin each coat, make sure you push against it, all right? Make sure the surface is nice and clean, all right? And it took me about three hours to mask this because I want all kinds of angle on this. So yeah, I want all kinds of, I'm gonna do this black. All this you see that you can see right now is gonna be black, 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 all around, right? And then after that, this is all, the one that's masked up is gonna be all red, the guy that in the front, all right? So that's what I'm gonna be doing there. But I need to push against on this tape. Um, there's a spot, a couple of spots where paint can escape. But other than that, it looks good, all right? So let me take it outside, and I'm gonna do three coats. All right, guys, uh, I'm all ready. Got this black paint here, all right? And I shook it up really well. Let's see. Yep, black, right there. And uh, I'm ready to paint. So I'm gonna do small coats nicely and easily, all right? Make sure your body is nice and clean and make sure you push against the surface that needs to be pushed all right so here it goes nothing so i'm gonna be doing in this angle all right the first coat is not gonna be too dark so don't worry about it all right Try to get all the sides because you see these edges here they are going to make a little difference to you if you get them in an the angle all right all right let me switch sides because these curves are going to be curves At the end, the hard work does pay off. Once you put this on the road, it's gonna look beautiful. Stay away from me guys. Alright guys, there we have it. That's my coat number one. Oh, these little corners can be confusing. So try to get them all, alright? There you go. Looks good to me. Did I miss anything? Nope. Alright, perfect. And I'm gonna let this dry and then I'm gonna give a second hand All right guys, I got my first coat dried up and how I dried it up was I put it in my instead of my car It's a hot summer day. So it dries up really fast. All right, that's how I'm drying this All right coat number two guys again same thing make sure you're not gonna see a missed spot this time So make sure you know which side you got and which side you didn't all right, so I'm gonna start off here
All right, there you go. You come on this side, same thing, guys. There you go, looks pretty good to me. All right, time for me to let this guy dry up really well. And then I'm gonna come back and give it a third coat. A little bit right there, all right? All right guys, nice and dry. Got my last coat. The paint is almost done anyway. One thing I do wanna say is before you take off the masking tape, make sure you let it dry really well, right? The reason is because once you peel it, it might peel with the paint, all right? Because the paint is not dried and stuck to the body yet, all right? All right, guys, I'm all done. And it's all ready to dry up again. And that was my third coat. There you have it, guys. All right? So, let me let this dry up. All right, guys. My body is all dried up. I put this plastic cover on so the dirt and debris doesn't get on it because I just left it dry for almost like two hours. All right? After it was baked inside the car for like 20 25 minutes all right each coating i let it get nice and hot inside my car it was almost 80 degrees here today all right so next what i'm gonna do here is one hand that's what i'm working with all right so i'm not gonna remove the film from the window or the window here or the window so the three windows stay intact after that i'll push this down so it sticks nicely and firmly but I'm going to remove this, all this uh, masking tape I'm going to remove from, let's look on this side. I'm going to remove all this masking tape, all this, all right, except the window, except the window, except the window. I'm going to remove the rest of the masking tape and I'm going to color this. I was thinking about coloring this yellow because it looks really nice. But I think the red is going to stick out really good too because I really want a red color here. Alright. So that's what we're looking at so far. And I'm going to remove this masking tape. Notice, paint got through right here. I cleaned that off with the the, the swab and uh, probably some kind of nail polish remover. And a little bit of here. Alright. A little bit of there. So it did get into little, little spots which is not even going to be noticeable. But... I will clean it off, all right? And that's about it, all right? It's looking pretty good. So all I'm gonna do is remove the masking tape. And then if this paint right here, I'll remove it with the uh, cotton swab and a little bit of a nail polish remover, all right? So that's gonna be that. All right, guys, I'm done uh, taking off all the masking tape. So as you can see, little spots right there that I'm gonna have to clean up cotton swab and a nail polish remover should take care of that all right when you're peeling peel slowly and gently because you don't want this paint if it's thick it'll peel with it right so I left the window here left the window here and the window there because that one is going to be just see through i'm not going to put nothing there and uh, i'm going to put a little bit of masking tape right here over here and in the front for that light all right so the front light backlight I'm gonna put a little bit of tape perfect design and that's how I'm gonna get the because I'm gonna put lighting on this car all right guys but gonna do a heck of a cleaning job internally on the inside I need to do a very good cleaning job here I'm gonna clean it up I'm gonna fix up the little mess that I have clean it really well so after this I'm gonna paint this red and after that I'm gonna paint it all white that be the last coat on above that's going to protect everything right it's going to protect the black and the white all right so stay tuned all right guys um i'm ready to paint the red now i got the light area i got a little cut out there cut out in the front end 
same thing on both sides and I'm all ready to paint this guy red I'm gonna do three coats same thing like any other coats then I'm gonna let it dry right all right guys got my red paint here and I'm gonna do same thing nice and even coating all right so I'll start off right here Alright, let me get one side first and then I'll go to the other side. Alright, that looks pretty good. Let me come over. I'll just twist it like that. Alright, so we don't have to worry about it because uh, the, it does have a clear cover. Don't worry about the scratches. But if you can put something underneath, that's even better. There you go. Perfect. Just do even coats. All right, I like the looks of that. I think I'll just let it dry here now. This little right right here is from the outside, so we don't worry about it. Once we take off the clear cover, it should be good. All right, let's let it dry. All right, guys, I'm ready to do another coat, and this is gonna be a thicker coat, all right? So here it goes. I think I'm only gonna get two coats running out of this thing. I could feel it, it's running out of pressure, but I should have enough for the whole car. All right, co two coats is not bad. I'm gonna make this really thick. Ah, people partying out there. All right, keep it going. make this coat really thick
All right, guys, there we have it. Just gotta let it dry up now, and then we'll do uh, one more coat of white over it that will cover everything. All right, guys, all dried up. Got the now have a white last protective coat. All right, so I'm gonna put this all over, and this is gonna protect everything. All right, and after that, you're done. Just do one coat. You don't need to do too many coats with this one. All right, so here it goes. I'll start off on the front. This is going to protect everything, guys. Everything. All right, that's it. I'm gonna leave it right there. It's time for us to let it dry. And then remove the clear coat, the clear foam outside. 